Hey everyone! Welcome to this video where we'll be solving the expert level Los Angeles Times Sudoku puzzle for January 13, 2024. Let's get started. Let's move to number 1. Only two positions left in the third box where value 1 can be placed. No other boxes have just two candidate cells available for the value 1. Let's move to number 2. Only two positions left in the first box where value 2 can be placed. Let's move to number 3. Only two positions left in the first box where value 3 can be placed. Let's move to number 4. Only two positions left in the fourth box where value 4 can be placed. Let's move to number 5. Only two positions left in the seventh box where value 5 can be placed. Let's move to number 6. In the third block, the number 6 can be directly placed. Only one position left in the third box where value 1 can be placed. Only two positions left in the ninth box where value 1 can be placed. Only two positions left in the third box where value 5 can be placed. Only two positions left in the ninth box where value 5 can be placed. Only two positions left in the first box where value 6 can be placed. Only two positions left in the fifth box where value 6 can be placed. Only two positions left in the fourth box where value 6 can be placed. Only two positions left in the eighth box where value 6 can be placed. Let's move to number 7. Only two positions left in the second box where value 7 can be placed. In the sixth block, the number 7 can be directly placed. Only two positions left in the fourth box where value 7 can be placed. Let's move to number 8. In the sixth block, the number 8 can be directly placed. Only two positions left in the sixth box where value 3 can be placed. In the ninth block, the number 3 can be directly placed. Only two positions left in the eighth box where value 3 can be placed. Let's move to number 9. There is only one possible value for cell row 4 column 2, which is 6. After eliminating all other numbers in its row, column, and block, the cell can only be filled with the value 6. Only one position left in the first box where value 6 can be placed. Only two positions left in the first box where value 9 can be placed. Only two positions left in the first box where value 7 can be placed. Please note that the cells marked in purple contain number pairs. There is an intersection with another region in subgrid 1. Value 7 has to be in one of the marked cells. So it cannot be in any other cell in row 3. Only one position left in the second box where value 7 can be placed. In the eighth block, the number 7 can be directly placed. In the seventh block, the number 7 can be directly placed. Only one position left in the fourth box where value 7 can be placed. Only one position left in the first box where value 7 can be placed. Only one position left in the first box where value 3 can be placed. Only one position left in the fourth box where value 4 can be placed. Only two positions left in the seventh box where value 1 can be placed. Only two positions left in the fourth box where value 1 can be placed. Only two positions left in the second box where value 3 can be placed. In the sixth block, the number 4 can be directly placed. Only one position left in the sixth box where value 3 can be placed. Only two positions left in the third box where value 4 can be placed. Only two positions left in the seventh box where value 4 can be placed. Only two positions left in the ninth box where value 4 can be placed. In the first block, 
the number 8 can be directly placed. In the second block, the number 8 can be directly placed. Only two positions left in the second box where value 4 can be placed. There is an intersection with another region in subgrid 2, value 4 has to be in one of the marked cells. So it cannot be in any other cell in row 2. Only one position left in the third box where value 4 can be placed. Only two positions left in the fourth box where value 8 can be placed. In the seventh block, the number 8 can be directly placed. Only one position left in the seventh box where value 5 can be placed. Only one position left in the ninth box where value 5 can be placed. Only one position left in the ninth box where value 4 can be placed. Only two positions left in the ninth box where value 2 can be placed. Only two positions left in the sixth box where value 2 can be placed. In the sixth block, the number 5 can be directly placed. Only two positions left in the fourth box where value 5 can be placed. Only two positions left in the fifth box where value 5 can be placed. There is an intersection with another region in subgrid 5, value 5 has to be in one of the marked cells. So it cannot be in any other cell in row 5. Only one position left in the fourth box where value 5 can be placed. Only one position left in the fourth box where value 1 can be placed. Only one position left in the fourth box where value 8 can be placed. Only 9 is missing in the fourth box. In the fifth block, the number 1 can be directly placed. Only 2 is missing in the fourth row. Only 9 is missing in the 6th box. Only 2 positions left in the 2nd box where value 1 can be placed. Only 2 positions left in the 5th box where value 8 can be placed. In the 8th block, the number 8 can be directly placed. Only 1 position left in the 5th box where value 8 can be placed. Only one position left in the 8th box where value 3 can be placed. Only one position left in the 2nd box where value 3 can be placed. Only one is missing in the 8th row. Only two positions left in the 5th box where value 2 can be placed. In the 5th block, the number 3 can be directly placed. Only one position left in the fifth box where value 5 can be placed. Only 9 is missing in the fifth row. In the second block, the number 5 can be directly placed. Only one position left in the second box where value 1 can be placed. Only one position left in the second box where value 4 can be placed. Only one position left in the third box where value 5 can be placed. Only two is missing in the second box. Only one position left in the fifth box where value 2 can be placed. Only one position left in the fifth box where value 6 can be placed. Only one position left in the eighth box where value 6 can be placed. Only two is missing in the fourth column. Only one position left in the ninth box where value two can be placed. Only nine is missing in the ninth box. Only one is missing in the sixth column. Only one position left in the seventh box where value one can be placed. Only one position left in the seventh box where value four can be placed. Only 9 is missing in the 7th row. Only 4 is missing in the 8th box. Only 2 is missing in the 7th column. Only 1 position left in the 1st box where value 2 can be placed. Only 1 position left in the 1st box where value 9 can be placed. 
Only nine is missing in the third box. This is the final result of the puzzle. Thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button so you never miss a video. Thanks again for tuning in and happy puzzling.